this idea of turning the pr traditional process on its head. You know, we clients get us involved, you know, in different ways, but they have a series of questions or there's stuff they want to find out. Here's what I want to do. We go away and investigate it. Come back. Here's the answer. Here are some thoughts and observations. Um, in the process, we've spoken to you know real people and filmed them and had meaning to their lives. What if you turned that around and you asked the members of the public what they wanted to know of the companies? And um, yeah. I'll tell you a story. Yes. Yeah, go. On. <laughs> um, one time, a client at Mars, uh, not not a direct client, but a friend of the client who worked at Mars, sat me down and said, "You know, when we have our boardroom meetings and we talk about consumers and stuff," mm. he said, "We talk in such weird language yeah. and vocabulary, and it'd be really good to have real people sitting in the meeting with us." Right. And um, and just telling us, what the hell are you talking about? Yeah. Just really challenging us, reality checking us, yeah. earthing us. As we talk, because you know, we take the piss out of them, sure. we can be derogatory, we can say things without realizing yeah. things. And it would just be really good to have real people in our brainstorm, mm. in our workshops. You know? mm. And uh, I thought that was a really exciting idea, except for it never happened. No. But is that the kind of thing you're talking about? Yeah, it is, absolutely. Um, turn the telescope around. Absolutely. You know? I mean, it's all the rage now to talk about co-creation and, and the like. And, you know, you get a whiff, you get a sense of it quite often doing interviews, I think. Well, you know, these are, you know, intelligent, able, competent people, you know, normal people, members of the public, whatever, who really have got a lot more to, to say than sometimes than we allow for absolutely. or we can capture. Um, and I just think it would be interesting, like as an experiment, it would be interesting to do that. I mean, as it happens, we're setting up a as well, with young, young 17 year olds, 16 to 18 year olds. And that's one of the things I'm really keen to experiment with, is, you know, what do you want to know? What do you want to know? Here's, whatever, you know, here's McDonald's, here's Heinz, here's Griffin. Well, the first here's question is, do they care? Yeah, sure. And then if they do care, what do they really care about? Not just what they think they should care about. Good point. Because most people don't actually give a monkeys about brands. In fact, which is interesting because the, you know, again, the, the terminology, the consumer, you know, what, what does that mean? Yeah. Consum to consume. It's a unit of currency. It's an economic, an economist um, probably came up with the term consumer because there is consumption, of course. And a unit of consumption is a, you know, the, the, the consumer is someone who buys a bag of sugar, right? Yeah. That's, so the whole thing, you know, it's not a person, it's a, it's a concept that's been, yes. that we've all adopted Created, and, and absolutely. used, but, it, but, it's, but it's based on nothing, it's based on nothing real, because that person buying a bag of sugar doesn't give a toss, it's no. tame line, as we know. Um, so the consumer this, the consumer that, all of that is, is fallacy. Well, it's a, it's a myth that we perpetuate. We in the marketing services industry perpetuate, which is again why if you if you unpack that or turn that around or whatever, yeah, what do they really want to? Know? They probably won't want to know anything about the brand, but increasingly they will want to know about so where did the strip come from and you know who made it and how did he pack it and was it a sweatshop and all that sort of thing? Because the you know marketing and manufacturing process is becoming much more open to scrutiny um, these days. So I suppose that's I suppose that's because that's what I'm grappling with is the quote new consumer.